start to worship the Lord. Worship the Lord. From the bottom of the heart. Let me step high. He's king. He's mighty. Amen. I don't know.
spread his love. Again and again. The love is good. All the time. All the time. All the time. All the good. Hallelujah. I'm the glory. I'm hallelujah to you. Amen. God is good all the time. We have a better. I'm going to have a better day today, so we are going to invite them. Amen. That's what we do in our church. If you, you remember, you have to give your, your date of birth. Als je leed bent, dan uh, geef je de uh, verjaardagdatum op. So that you will celebrate your birthday. Amen. Dat we samen hier kunnen vieren. You give something small. Amen. Een klein te geven. So, I will welcome our one and daily announcer and everything. Mr. Paul. So I will invite our sister Nuala.
That's what they catch me child mind. Split the part of us. You know, come on over. Your problem is being listened to. But that should be there for no then. Our, our pastor is somebody you can rely on. Onze pastor is iemand waar je op kan bouwen. Because somebody you can feel confident of. En waar je vertrouwen kan hebben. Anything you have, any problem is occurring in your life. Okay. Nika? Please let me contact. Dan kun je hem met hem contact uh, opnemen. We started a few people, but today we give time to God. We zijn gewoon met een paar mensen van vandaag en we dank voor God. So we continue the job, we continue to grow in Jesus' name. Yeah, so I'm not even going yet. What are the days for fast? So I'm in Canada. I'm gonna call up uh what's up? Emmanuel and Keith. The the phone was yeah, so as I was telling. So the time for us to come and come to the book of them have a they want to see for Amen. Amen. We gaan het akoestisch doen. Dus uh, shh.
first time for our Lord. Let that chant and go on to the end.
a little bit of a udas. Overall, I guess I guess that. The passage of the Bible, the Talmudics, and after which you're going to bless the food you're going to eat. Most of them, they are, they are close to state. <laughs> so when they come close to you, they are smelling everywhere. <laughs> but the same clothes is full of blood of animals. <laughs> and sweat. <laughs> and a lot of mess, too, you know? <laughs> but you know, when they kill the bush meat and bring it, we love the meat. <laughs> People didn't like the clothes of the bushman because it stinks. But we enjoy his meat. <laughs> Hallelujah. That's because we're going to call Lord Jesus. Amen. You know why I want to say this? A lot of people enjoy Christmas, but they kick Jesus out of Christmas. Without Jesus, there is no Christmas. Say amen. amen. Because it is Him who made Christmas. Even though I, I don't believe Jesus was born on 25th December, I don't believe. Then, at least, we have a day that we celebrate the birth of Jesus. I want to sit down in a few minutes. Because the food is getting warmer. Amen. 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 Today we're going to eat and eat and eat and drink. Amen. Amen. Let, me make, let me make this announcement. In this place, I'm sorry, but there is it is it is not allowed any alcohol here. If you want to drink alcohol, you find maybe outside or something. I don't drink alcohol, but for respect for Jesus. Amen? So if you have alcohol with you, bring it outside. Yeah. God bless you. Also, there is no smoking in the building. Man, Jesus is, I, I personally find it difficult for, for those who don't believe in Jesus. I find it difficult, personal. You know why? Because just one person who was born into this world, and the birth of this one person, time begins to start. We have AD before Jesus. Uh, BC. BC. Before the birth of Jesus. And then we have AD. After, After. It's not, not you see, oh, when you please, you know, if you see this human being called Jesus Christ, and because of Jesus, time begin to read, and then stop it. Death started because of one person. And there are eight of them uh, But there were many people who were born before Jesus. But there were some before you. Why is Jesus Christ so unique? Why is he so unique? It's because he is a, a gift 
that God himself gives to us. Everybody say a gift. Amen. In Christmas, what, what do we see in Christmas? Can somebody raise your hands and tell me what you see during Christmas time? And I'll tell, I'll tell you what it means. Nobody knows what we do in Christmas. Come on, let me see your hand. And then, uh, what do we do? Celebration? Okay. Uh, what? Christmas tree? We don't have it yet. Okay. Who else? Togetherness. Mm -hmm. A lot of pray. A lot of pray. Pray. Amen. No, you're not. Parties. Oh. Nobody about Christmas here. Hey, sister. What are we doing Christmas? What do you see? Everything. Christmas. Uh -huh. Okay. Yes. Is it from Canada? I don't know. Okay. Who else? We don't see Santa Claus. Okay. Okay. Christmas also we see gifts, isn't it? The gifts are coming down. In Christmas time we see a lot of light, isn't it? I see the Christmas time we see a tree. The green dog. We see a lot of gold. That's why I have bling bling. You know. And then, we see gold colors. Green colors. Green colors. Red colors. All these things point to Jesus. Ever say it point to what? Jesus. Who have ever received a present or a card in this Christmas? Who has received something? We have a So nobody has received a card. Christmas card. Oh, okay, okay. okay. It's a gift, isn't it? Okay, God bless you. Do you, what, do you know what it means? During Christmas, when we share gifts among ourselves, showing that God Himself is the one who gave us Jesus Christ as a gift to the whole world. Everybody put your hands together for the Lord. Hallelujah! Jesus is a gift. Yes, it's on the door. And if you receive a gift, you have to open it. And as you got the Christ, then you open it. And begin to enjoy the gift. And the family. God Almighty, who some of you believe that God doesn't exist. Some of you believe that God is not. I tell you, He exists. Amen. I tell people that even if you have to come to death for me to defend that God exists, I will be ready to die. Because he exists more than you can think of. And because he loves you, he gave us a gift. Amen? Have you ever received a gift from your enemy? Maybe you get a, a bomb. <laughs> bomb in an envelope. <laughs> from your enemy. But anytime you receive a gift, it's because somebody cares for you, isn't it? When somebody loves you and he cares for you and he remembers you, then he gives you a gift. You see, most of your so called friends, they even forgot to give you a Christmas card, isn't it? Some of they said they, they love you. They said okay. 2,000 years ago, God knows that He knows that we know. Even though if we don't know, God knows that He loves us. Amen. And He allowed a certain virgin called Mary to be born, a, to be born a man called Jesus Christ. It is only Jesus' birth that we do what angels begin to sing. That is what we sound today. Amen. Amen. The angels sing that be born, a savior is born to the world. Amen. And even the angels begin to celebrate. Thousands and thousands of them they were singing praises to God because Jesus was born as a gift. To the whole world. He, he came with a mission. Just like I came to Holland 12 years ago with a mission. 
God said, go to Holland. And go and preach my love to the people. Amen. God said, many years ago, 200 years ago, Nello people came to Africa with the gospel of Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. And we, Africans, receive the gospel. And our life is transformed because there is power in the gospel of Jesus Christ. Amen. We stop human sacrifice. We stop voodoo and all kinds of satanism. We receive Jesus Christ and we stop most of us stop criminalities. And we worship Jesus and we love Jesus and we serve God with all our heart. We're looking unto the people who brought the good news of Jesus. They love their faith. God said, I love them, so go back to Holland. Amen. And bring the message of Jesus back to Holland. Say amen. Oh, you don't want to clap your hand. Amen. Put your hands together for the Lord Jesus. So Jesus loves you. The reason why Jesus came is to come and show you the way to the Father. Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. He is the savior of the world. The Bible says that when the angel came, he said, This man you shall have, you will be pregnant by the Holy Spirit, and that man will be called Jesus. That child will be called Jesus. And the, and the angel said, Mary. That baby you are carrying will be the savior of the world. And the baby is from the world. God saved us from all kinds of atrocities and wrong things. But when you give your life to Jesus, Jesus begins to work in your heart. And when you finish your heart, you become another person. And we know that we have Jesus. When you die today, there is life after death. There is a place. Everybody said there is a place. Some people said, well, I've never been there, so I don't believe there is a place. Let me tell you, you can be there, but you can never come back. <laughs> that is the bad news. So if you are waiting to be there, you can, you can be there. But you need to choose to be there before you be there. Amen. If the choice is yours today. Amen. Jesus wants you to be in a better place. Amen. He loves you. He cares for you. And this Christmas, I trust you. And I want to promise you. I want you to make me a promise that you are not going without Jesus. Amen. Because Jesus cares. Amen. He wants the best for you. He wants the future for you. He is the king. Not just a king, but the king of kings. The whole world, we have a lot of kings and queens. We have a lot of Kings and queens, but Jesus is the King of kings and Lord of lords. Amen. He is the King of kings and Lord of lords. He is the shepherd of your soul. He is the one who said, Let there be light, and there will be light. And Jesus said, There will be light in your life, there will be light. I live in Amsterdam, Zola. You know, I put stars and a lot of lights in my room. Maybe as I'm standing here, the light is still shining everywhere. Even though maybe the, the energy will go high, but I don't care. Because I see light everywhere. 
It shows that Jesus is the light of the world. Amen. I said Jesus is what? The light of the world. When Jesus comes to your life, your life will never be the same. The whole world is full of darkness. Darkness of wicked people. Darkness of evil. Darkness of jealousy. Darkness of depression. Darkness of sickness and disease. Darkness of frustration and loneliness. The whole world is full of darkness. Darkness of what? Heartbrokenness and divorce. Darkness of pride. One time a lady told me, the Pastor, you don't know what I'm going through. I cry a whole night until my pillow become wet. I say, you know what? Jesus won't wipe off all your tears. Amen. Because Jesus is the light. To every darkness of tears in your life, Jesus is able to bring the light. Amen. Today, if you give your life to Jesus, don't care about what the politicians say. Don't care about them, what the revolutionaries say. The revolutionaries. Don't care about the TV. Don't even care about me. Just care about Jesus. That Jesus came onto this earth 2,000 years ago. And for, for this reason, we celebrate Christmas. Amen. Amen. So you make a decision today. Don't care about the religion you came from or you were born into. You make a decision today. That today, 25 December, I gave my life to Christ. And let me tell you, when you give your life to Christ, you will never regret. Amen. If you see any Christian who say, "Yeah, I'm tired of being Christian." I be a Christian and I don't I don't see any fulfillment of life. I'm not sure if I had it, but maybe, maybe I had it before. If you hear such people, that means they have not really given their heart really to Jesus. But if you really, 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 really give your life to Jesus, you will never be regretted. Amen? Because he makes you joy. In times of trouble, he is there with you. He speaks to your heart. In times of pain, he is there. In times of sickness and disease, even he heals your body. So give your life today to Jesus Christ. And your life will never be the same. Say amen to Jesus. I'm going to put your hands together for the Lord Jesus. Amen. Before, before the kitchen and everything is ready, I want to announce to you that the reason why we made this party is because we want to share our love. We, we hope we were expecting maybe more than, not more than UK, but no problem. I think we're going to have more food and less over. Amen. <laughs> I believe that's what the Bible says in Luke chapter 6. It says we bless us, shaking together, running over. You know, you get more than enough and close, you can give some out. Amen. That's what God wants to do. Amen. Feel free and take. We have about eight or nine different. Nationality food. <laughs> so enjoy. Amen. We are going to pray about the food so that when you eat, you don't get any trouble. <laughs> I hope the Africans didn't bring hot pepper here. Because the Africans feel people eat too much hot and then they get stomach pain. But we don't have hot, I think. So enjoy with us. For those of you who don't have any place to go and listen to the message of Jesus Christ, those of you who don't have any 
please go and listen to the message of Jesus Christ. This is the best place for you. And that's why we do this party. That we organize and share the love. So you are always welcome. Come and listen and come and bring all your questions and we are going to answer them. In Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Now, I want to bless you all and then we can start there. Amen. Amen. Can you close your eyes if you don't mind? Father God, in Jesus' name, Thank you for today. For set the word of all people who has come here to celebrate Jesus Christ with us. But that Christmas is all about Jesus. You want to worship him. You want to bless your name. You want to give you praise. But as we come to eat here and enjoy and drink, we ask you the Lord God Almighty. You sanctify this food for us. Cleanse this food for us. And make this food a profitable, or even when we eat, it will be our body's nourishment. Lord, touch every heart. The those who come here, the love that you give it to us, we will share among ourselves. And we all will know that. Truly, Jesus Christ is the Savior to the world. In the Savior is the Savior to the world. In bless your name, Lord. In Jesus' name. Amen. Now, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, I bless the food and I sanctify it and I drink and everything. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Can you go to somebody and maybe shake somebody and tell Merry Christmas to somebody? Amen.